Hello. In this video, we will see how the host staging works in Discovery. We can find an age count of a host by searching it in a customize option here. For example, this host has an age count 4. Let's scan this host. The scan is complete. The result is successful. Let's check the age count for this host. I will refresh the page. The age count for this host became 5. As with every successful scan, the age count is incremented by 1. Let's take another example. This host has an age count minus 2. Let's scan this host. The scan failed. Let's check the age count for this host. It become minus 3. As with every subsequent fail scan, the age count is decremented by 1. Aging is controlled by model maintenance settings. Here, the device aging access failures, which specifies the access failure limit for a device, is 7 failures by default and device aging time limit which specifies the aging time limit for the device is 10 days by default. This is called as an aging threshold. When the aging threshold is reached, the discovery destroys the device and the removal will sync the mark as deleted flag in CMDP to yes in ADDM dataset. Here, the number of credential failures that count as one failed access setting plays an important role. By default, five credential failures are counted as one failed access. To see the entire list of hosts which are near this destruction threshold, please go to Explore, Reports, and Device Near Removal Threshold Report. This report will show you the list of scanned devices that have not been confirmed and are near their removal thresholds. The report will also show you the approximate indication of removal deadline. For example, this host was scanned successfully three years ago. The scan for this host has been failed five times consecutively. And this host is eligible for removal after two more scan failures. Thanks for watching.